Hi, it's Dr. Ember with uh, a moment of straight talk about uh, drooping eyelids. When the skin on the upper eyelids uh, drops and becomes redundant or um, excessive and actually begins to touch the lashes is when most women really recognize the fact that something has to be done. Because when they're putting eye makeup on and they have to lift up the eyebrow to be able to do it, you know there's a little too much skin. Um, the operation that um, yeah, corrects this is called the blepharoplasty. What we do is very, very simply removing the skin in the upper eyelid in the anatomical crease so you don't see the mark, taking the fat pads out and uh, closing the incision up and you have no more redundant skin, you have no more drooping eyelids. Now, if that's uh, an oversimplification because some people have a problem due to the muscle uh, that lifts up the lid, and that's called ptosis, and that requires slightly more uh, complex surgery because the muscle has to be tightened. And um, in other people, the problem is caused by the eyebrow drooping, in which case um, a lift of the eyebrow is necessary. But those are the ways we treat uh, drooping upper eyelids, and all of them are effective, but you have to use the right procedure for the right problem.